Hey, five fans, it's Michelle Joy Phelps, and I'm joined now with Carlos Takam. Carlos, it's good to see you. The last time that I saw you was when you were just about to fight Anthony Joshua on yes, like 10 days' that. notice. Yeah. Oh, sorry. <laughs> Have you hold that up? There you yeah. go. Yes. Yeah. How are you doing? I'm good. I'm yeah? very good. Yes. I'm good. Thank you. Yeah. Yes. Well, you just got off the stage now with Joe Joyce. Um, you guys didn't do much talking. You know, it sort of just kept it pretty, I don't know, pretty clean <laughs> for the most part. It could have gotten nasty, but it didn't. Yeah, um, yeah. Especially after hearing that there was a spy in your camp. I mean, were you unaware that someone was in the gym uh, sending footage to uh, Sam uh, Jones? Uh, I really don't know. I really don't know why that happened. Yeah. I really don't know. I don't know who. I don't know who. So, so, so the thing I want, I, I just want to say is, if Sam Jones, if Sam Jones, like he said, he spy me or he know how I was fight, means say that guy, they, they, they scare of me. Mm. Why they come spy me if they don't scare of me? You know, mm. I don't want to go. I don't want to go spy George Jones because you know I don't. I don't. I don't do that. You know, mm. I don't do that. They scold me. That one to come. I don't know. They come in Vegas to spy me. That's it. Yeah. Do you find it offensive? Say again. Do you find it offensive? Mm, yes, it's offensive. Yeah, of course. Yeah. Why? Why do do that? Mm -hmm. Because I don't want to go do that. Why do do that? I have my team. We we we, we was training in Vegas. We don't know if somebody in my account. Uh, 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 report to uh, uh, give the information for mm -hmm. them. I don't know who do mm -hmm. that. So he do that. So I just want to say that guy. I don't know him. He don't know me. If mm -hmm. he gonna, if he respect me, I respect him. I don't have no respect for him because I'm sorry. Yes. Well, Sam was also mentioning Francis and Ganu as if implying that they were on his side because he said that they texted him wishing him luck. Do you feel like he was just trying to get under your skin? Yeah. No, 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 no. I don't think I, I don't think it's Francis Ngannou text him to say or I don't know to say something. Mm -hmm. but I don't think so. Maybe Francis talk, text him to say, okay, good luck because right. he know me because he know I'm gonna win the fight. Just say good luck. Yes. So. I speak with Francis every time, every day, you know. Yeah. He called me every time to, 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 to say, hey, Carlos, how are you today? So even today, too, this morning, he called me to take a news of my so, so I don't think Francis, like he say, Francis in, in his car, no. I don't think so. That's his shit. <laughs> that is not true. <laughs> it's the hurt business. You said you're looking to hurt him. He's yes. going to look to hurt you. He's lo hoping for a, a knockout. He has stopped all but one of his opponents. How do you feel that you differ from the other opponents that he's going to be facing? Listen, I just want to say, George uh, uh, never fight, never fight somebody like Carlos Takam. That's it. He never fight somebody like me. So if he think because he watched my video, my fight with Joshua or whatever, he think mm -hmm. that how I'm going to fight with him on Saturday, I say good luck. He gonna he gonna see different Carlos Takam Saturday, mm -hmm. definitely. The news broke with the WBO saying that. If he is to win, Joe Joyce, then he then becomes the WBO mandatory to face Usyk, the winner of Usyk and Joshua. Um, what do you make of them saying that that's the case for him, but they didn't imply as though it was an option for you? You know, that is, I don't know how to, to answer that question because that question, uh, I think my manager got, can, can answer that question because that question is a business question, you know. Mm. It's not a fight. <laughs> <laughs> it's a business question. That question you're going to ask my manager. But, uh, that, you're gonna but obviously you. you would hope for that, right? You would hope for that because it would give you an opportunity to, to face the winner. Yes, no, yeah. yes, of course, of course. But after, after the fight, after my win, you're going to speak about that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right, so can we expect a knockout? Are we looking for a knockout? Is that not even, I mean... Some guys are only going there for the aim of stopping their opponent. But for you, is it just about getting the win? You know what? That fight is not going to be easy fight for him, for me. So he's going to try to knock me out. I'm going to try to knock me out. Mm -hmm. If he try to knock me out and then he can, it's going to be my time to knock you out. Mm -hmm. Yes. So you guys got to stand up there, look eye to eye. Did you see anything in his eyes? No, he was trying to intimidate me like, you know, like I said. I say, come on, man. I'm a lion from Africa. They don't, they don't do that with me. I'm a lion definitely from Africa. The way I'm coming from, you cannot do that. I'm not scared everyone. No, I'm not scared him. I'm not scared everyone. He don't intimidate me, no. Definitely, no. Do you have a prediction? Prediction? I'm going to win my fight. That is a prediction. <laughs> come on. <laughs> I Fair come enough. to win that fight. This is Carlos Takam Town. Definitely. Yes. All right. Well, thank you so much for your time. Thank Wish you, you all the best on Saturday thank night. And we'll hopefully catch up with you post-fight. Right. Thank, right. thank you. Bye, Fight fans.
Hey Fi fans, it's Michelle Joy Phelps. If you haven't already subscribed to our YouTube channel, make sure you do so by clicking this icon right here, or else 